Okay guys, so before this tutorial starts, I want you to check out RaymondDigital.com. It's basically a website where you can get like really awesome high quality intro templates that are really easy to edit. All the info is in the description down below. What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome to a new video and today, yes today, I'm gonna show you guys how to make the lightsaber effect. Guys, I wanna mention like this is a little bit more advanced, you know, it's gonna be like about masking and doing something frame per frame. That's what I'm gonna do today. The only thing you need like is just like a stick, then you're gonna make it like a lightsaber. So you just need a random stick, so I'm just gonna find a stick somewhere, I'm just gonna shut off the recording real quick. I'm just gonna find myself a nice stick so I can hold it up while editing the actual video. So let me grab a stick and then actually when I got this one, I actually, let's jump straight the video hey guys so you can see me you can also comment in the freaking comments you can call me a retard i don't care this is just for the purpose of showing you guys how to make a lightsaber so first of all what you need to make actually a lightsaber is like something like a stick and i would say like get like a silver or white or something because it's easy to track it's also nice because you have like i have like a nice like, grip in, the, in here so i can you know hold it like this you know this black thing doesn't matter because you're just gonna you know like mask over it anyway so what i'm gonna do now is you just want to you know like, you don't want to make your scene so I'm just gonna you know stand right here and I'm gonna hold your lightsaber like this and what is gonna happen when I'm just gonna move my stick you just want to mask it along with the movement it can be frame per frame guys don't judge me it takes a word but if you want to have like a nice video you also want to take you also want to put time in it what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna hold the stick like right here like this boom and this is gonna be on my lightsaber so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move my stick and I'm just gonna show you guys that you can make a lightsaber out of something random like this so first of all what I'm gonna do now is I'm just gonna move like make a movement with my stick I'm gonna show you guys how to do that so first of all I'm just gonna start this is basically how to do it you want to hold your stick and you want to like move it like really slow so you actually can you can move with it you know you can you know you can do it like different speeds and stuff it doesn't matter uh, but you just want to you know like move it so you actually can see like you can you can mask you can mask you can ma you can mask it and stuff so that is basically how you can how you can do it and if I move it like this you just have to mask it like all the way this is gonna take a long work the more I, the more I move this is gonna take a lot more work I'm just gonna turn it off so this is my lightsaber so now it's just a stick again as you guys can see like a random stick and <laughs> that's basically it so thank you guys and I hope you guys enjoy Alrighty then. As you guys can see, I'm in Sony Vegas right now, and basically to make a lightsaber like like th that you guys just saw, it's a lot of work actually. But you need you need to put time and effort in this. So basically, what you want to do first is, of course, you ha will have your footage like right here. This is just the footage that you, that you guys saw that that you guys just saw unedited. So the first thing you want to do is you want to create a new video track. Boom, and then you another one. Boom. So you create two video track and video two video tracks and basically. To start off, you want to um, choose the color of your lightsaber. As you guys saw, I chose blue because actually blue is like my favorite color. But you can also use red. So let's say we want to have a red lightsaber this time. You want to go to uh, media generators. You want to pick a solid color and you want to pick red like this. Boom. You want to drag that on top, yeah, on the first track actually, on this one. Close that out for a second. And then to make actually, you know, to make it like glow, like really, really nice. You want to add a white one on top. So we're gonna drag it on here like this. Boom. What we want to do now or next is this is gonna take the, like the most work uh, and time. So um, basically, to start off, you want to um, make a start position. So let's say I'm gonna, I'm gonna start right, like right here. When I'm just gonna move my stick, you just wanna. So I'm gonna drag it all to the beginning, and this is actually how I did it, but then just with the blue cover. Okay. So um, as you can as you can see. Um, we just want to, you know, put this one. You want to put the opacity down for a second uh, from right to zero because we don't need it actually. And then you also want to put like the half, you know, of the red also down the opacity until like, well, like, I don't know, like this. Um, or you can use like half because you want to see through the red where your lightsaber goes when you, with your movement. So let's click on this icon. Let's see this one, the middle one. And as you guys can see, we have just this square. As you can see, this red square. This is actually the window you are going to mask in. But the thing you want to do is you want to click on mask at the bottom. This one. You want to click on the anchor creation tool. And you want to start making like this, I say outline. Boom. And as you guys can see on the screen, we have a red line. 
and to actually to make this move like the green like the red with the on onto the stick you want to zoom in and as you guys can see on the preview screen you want to hold control and click on this icon so you actually you know can drag it around as you can see on the screen like this as you guys can see on my screen if you hold control you can you can drag the sides and what you want to do is you want to go you want to look at your preview screen and you want to put this one exactly over the lightsaber so you can move all those corners so i'm just gonna do that right now as you guys can see i'm just gonna put this corner at the bottom like right here that should that should be fine um, I'm gonna put this one a little bit back like this then this one you also want to put that like right there and this one you want to put that right there we have now this you want to you want to move up a few frames like this so as you guys can see the lightsaber is going down a little bit so we're just gonna follow the actual lightsaber so we're gonna put this down like we did in the beginning drag this one on it that is basically guys how you need to do everything in the same motion so this is the tactic and the way you need to apply it to it to make sure you know everything goes with it so basically to you know actually to speed up this process i'm just going to do a few more frames so you guys actually understand what to do so as you guys can see going a few frames you can click on those buttons on like under the preview screen and as you guys can see if we go back this is you know where the you know lightsaber is and then you want to go, go, go you know, forward a few frames then you want to also go back to your field as you guys can see in this one and you want to hold control and you want to drag the corners onto the lightsaber again to say this really simple you just need to follow the lightsaber where it goes you just want to you know go free like move up a few frames and then you just want to follow the lightsaber where it goes you want to actually hold control and then you can like put this one like where they're supposed to be always cover the actual stick to make it look like a lightsaber and then basically uh, I'm not gonna show you guys like how to do this entirely because then this video would be like an hour long if I would like do all of this and like all of this as you guys can see this entire piece so this is what the beginning looks like when I'm just gonna move my stick you just want to mask it along with the movement as you guys did you guys see that so as you guys can see it's looping right now and as you guys can see the red moves along with it so that's what you need to do for the entire clip and it's, and let's say you're done you want to add those really cool effects the first thing you want to do is you want to pull you want to pull up you know the opacity again to about 100 then you want to go to video effects and you want to put gaussian blur on it so as you guys can see there we have the red stick you want to put a gaussian blur on it boom that is like a little bit blurry then is that and that's that you want to put a gaussian blur on the white one as you can see i'm going and you want to put that to to soften you want to drag up the opacity. There we have a lightsaber, guys. It looks really good. You can also you can also you know apply a glow to it if you want to. Freaking amazing! I'm gonna play it back to you guys so you can see um, how it looks. So this is the lightsaber. That is basically how simple it is, guys. It's a lot of work, I know, but just you need to put effort in it. That's what I always. That is what. That's what I did because the clip that you guys saw in the beginning, I worked on that for like 45 minutes, only that piece, because you need to be like frame per frame actually, and that's gonna take a really long time. But but that's how simple it is. That is how simple it is, guys. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the continued support. I will see you guys actually in one hour for an extra video. Yes, this video is called "Getting My First Subaru BRZ." And for the people who think like Alex, you're talking bullshit. You never get that car. It's like a thirty thousand dollar car. Well, just guys watch the video in one hour it's like a really nice video it's like an action video so make sure to check out the video in one hour from now and then actually in two hours from now i'll be showing you guys my color correction presets because everyone requests that make sure to check out my channel in like one hour and two hours from now so thank you guys for watching thank you guys for the continued support and i will see you guys in one hour Okay, so the first thing is that you don't want to do in your car, playing around with your cell phone. Drop comments down below and I'll be more happy to make a video about it. My own clothing line through the description down below. Even if you're not a subscriber correctly and quickly, Twitter and verification process, you can find a link down below. I'm done with this kind of shit. Opportunity is there. As long as you guys keep watching my videos, I will keep making them.